Hey, I wanted to share something that uh, has kind of been a common theme for us when we're sitting down with clients that we're starting to see. Uh, we're sitting down with clients and we're talking about what are your uh, overall goals and objectives and what are your specific digital marketing goals and your marketing goals. Uh, and when we talk about that, we talk about a lot of times what that organization is doing from a marketing perspective. And they think that that is their strategy. Uh, but a lot of time that's just marketing activity. So uh, I wanted to kind of share this thought that we have because we have this kind of fight uh, or something in our heads that we think we have marketing strategy, but it's really just marketing activity. And a lot of companies have marketing activity without the strategy where we kind of have to switch uh, we have to switch that and we have to have a strategy first and then build out these marketing activities. So I'll give you an example of that. Uh, a marketing strategy is really defining what your overall goals as a company is and what objectives you want to achieve. You know, what do you want your marketing to achieve? Do you want more brand awareness? Do you want to try and get higher revenues, leads for your sales team or your business development team? Do you want to get more market share? Do you want to pull in uh, more customers from your competitors? Do you just want engagement and visibility online to get that brand awareness uh, digitally? So once you have that, uh, we can kind of build out the marketing strategy and what specific message you want to send for your product or your services. Uh, and then the strategy should consist on what platforms are we going to uh, um, deliver this message on. Uh, and one thing that we see, a lot of people may, might not understand social platforms and how to utilize them or digital platforms in general on how to use, utilize them. Uh, an example of that is, you know, I'm a business to business company. At Life Stages, we want our, our market is CEOs, vice presidents, upper management, marketing directors, business development directors. Those are the type of people we want uh, to connect with uh, to try and get leads from. Uh, so us focusing on Facebook to try and generate and make connections doesn't make a lot of sense. Uh, Facebook is a B2C platform. So a lot of companies may spend a lot of time, resources, and money trying to build a Facebook presence, throw a lot of content on Facebook, spend money on ads and promotions, but your target market isn't there. Uh, you know, that all of that time and the money and the resource would be better allocated to LinkedIn where there's that business to business connection. That's the business to business platform. Uh, if you are a B2C company and you're trying to get to the consumer, Facebook is a great platform. And I would say, hey, let's build that out. And then let's build that and collect the analytics and the engagement and then try and really elevate that for our business development and sales team. Uh, and, and it's the same for business to business on LinkedIn and maybe some other platforms. So that's something that we discuss. You know, do you have a specific strategy within that strategy? Uh, are you conveying your message on the right platform where your target market is? You know, are, are your industry leaders there? Uh, and then the last part of the strategy from a marketing standpoint is, is it time bound uh, and you, can you create actionable uh, you know, items to, to try and secure leads uh, or does it specifically elevate your business development and sales department? We want to create processes for companies uh, that really from a marketing perspective and a marketing strategy, we can collect all this analytics and data and then we can actually give something tangible to lift up and elevate and I always like to use the verbiage, put the ball on the T for our business development, our sales, our estimators, whoever that is. Um, so does it do that? Does it really elevate and make their jobs easier? Um, if not, then you probably need to reassess what you're doing or how you're doing it. Um, you know, there's a lot of things out there online that we share with people uh, that can build out customer service business development and marketing programs and they're inexpensive or even free it's just how do you customize it for your particular business and your particular industry uh, so that's something that we are really really proficient at and we would love to share that with you uh, you know we're here to try and make that roadmap for you we can we can train you on how to do a lot of this inside so you don't have to have a big agency if you want a big agency great but we can still show you how to do some of these day-to-day -day processes and how you can do it for relatively inexpensive uh, and a lot of uh, the technology that's available to us now it, the purpose is to automate integrate and um, align those three areas, customer service, business development, and, and marketing to really have uh, a really streamlined, effective program from, from A uh, to C when it comes to those three areas of organization. So 
the solution is define your sales goals uh, or your marketing goals to achieve your sales goals. Uh, you know, really have purposeful marketing processes to deliver your your um, your message and what specific platforms. If th those are things that you need help with, we'd love to talk to you about you know where your business should be, what platforms uh, it should be on to achieve your target market. Uh, and uh, the last thing is, is it really elevating um, your business development sales? So if, if you see your company in, you know, maybe or lacking in, in one of these areas, we'd love to have a conversation. You know, I really hope that this video uh, was beneficial for you. Uh, if you have questions, reach out, to, you know, comment on Facebook. You can always uh, send us an email uh, or you can give me a call. All of our contact uh, information is there on our page. But I really appreciate it, and it's just something that we really thought we would share because we're seeing so much of it. Uh, and, and with it being a common theme, you know, if, if this is your business or you fall in these areas, we'd love to have a conversation with you. Again, I hope this was helpful. Have a great day. Bye.